you for joining me again. Now, this video is about a new bench shirt that I've got. It's been out uh, on the market for a few years now. Uh, it's by a brand that I've never really mentioned. Uh, it's, uh, the brand is Oni. It's a Japanese based brand. Uh, it does a lot of powerlifting kit. It's all IPF approved. Uh, notably, they've got wrist wraps, a belt. Uh, the belt, it's a 13mm. Uh, thickness and uh, 10 centimeter uh, or 4 inch uh, width. Uh, they've got, so we mentioned wrist wraps, the belt. Uh, they've got a single, a non sportive single for raw lifting. Uh, and they've got a bench shirt. Uh, all those have been used to break IPF world records and some still hold world records in certain uh, weight and equipment classes. Uh, so I'm going to jump straight into it and I'm going to show you it. This is the uh, Oni Homura Bench Press Shirt. Uh, let's open it up. I've trained in this shirt, I believe, twice. It's a very good fitting shirt. Uh, goes on easy enough. Uh, I'll definitely be wanting to size down in it if uh, my fortune keeps going good. Uh, so as you can see, it's got the IPF logo on the chest plate. It's got a really firm collar, very similar to the Super Katana low cut bench shirt. It's a angled sleeve bench shirt, which I've never used before. Uh, primarily they're used for arch bench presses, but I've uh, not encountered any problems with this specific bench press shirt. Again, we see the brand uh, Oni on the left sleeve. Uh, and a symbol on the right sleeve. So, stitching. Stitching is uh, very similar to the Super Katana. Uh, again, the arms are very good and very well stitched. Uh, fabric on the back, again, like all uh, bench shirts, stretchy. Uh, it's very thickly stitched around the bottom, that's very notable. I've not encountered any Titan bench shirt like that. I've only used Titan bench shirts before. Uh, so, next thing with it, sizing. Uh, so, most people know the size is working from a Titan size guide. Uh, me, if I want a slack fitting shirt that'll slide on easy enough, I'll go for a 42. Uh, that's equivalent to a large in the Homura. Uh, that's the name of this specific bench shirt. So a 42 is a large, uh, 44 equivalent is an extra large. You can probably work that going up. You, you can work that out. And a 40 is a medium. Again, you can work that out going down. It goes down to an extra small, which uh, will be a 36. Again, uh, this is a 42. I'm definitely going to be sizing down in this and getting myself a size uh, 40 equivalent or a medium. Uh, see how that goes. Uh, again, so my review of this shirt, I think it's a very good shirt. Uh, before I bought it, I did a bit of research into it, asked a few questions on a few message boards. Where would you rank it in the Titan, Titan scale? So for those that don't know, at the bottom of the scale we've got the Fury and the F6. Then we've got the Katana. Uh, we've got the Super Katana High Collar and Super Katana Low Collar. Most people would place this between the Katana and the Super Katana High Collar. Uh, which is sort of like the step that I'm trying to make. Uh, so this is benefiting very well. Uh, I believe it's uh, going to help me a lot in my training. Another notable thing before I was buying this, a lot of equipped benches will uh, grab the bar out and tuck their elbows in, like really tuck them in and tuck them in, and then when they reach the chest, spring back. Uh, whereas me, uh, with benching raw for so long, I'm struggling to make that transition. And a uh, key uh, benefit of this shirt is it claims uh, it allows you to bench a bit more naturally with arms a bit wider and maybe only tucking this much. Uh, the tuck is still there obviously, you can't just bench like that, it's tight and it wants to be uh, put in the most beneficial position. So it gives you a slight tuck and allows it to really pop up very well. Another thing uh, exclusive with a shirt, 
from what I was reading was how stiff and strong the fabric is. Uh, the, I believe it's a lot stronger than the Titan, uh, the stuff that Titan shirts are made out of. Uh, I get, you know for well if you've watched me before reviewing equipped gear. Uh, I can't remember the name for the sub, uh, the substance, uh, the poly. Uh, yeah, the, the poly one. I'm no good with the name, uh, but it's 100% made of that. Uh, all over, all around. The stitches are made of that material. Uh, so again, that just shows you how well stitched it is. I know Titan products have a one and a half year guarantee on blowouts. I believe. I believe one and a half years, eighteen month. Uh, I didn't have a thorough look at this, uh, but someone tells me it's a year, not the eighteen month. Uh, but again, it's not ridiculously tight. I shouldn't experience any of that, especially uh, with the weight I'm lifting. It's big weight, where it ain't. Yeah, it's not massive. Big for my age, but for the open age class, I'll be squeezing in extremely tight gear. This is that. That is nothing. And then the final thing to note is how tight it is around the arms. Uh, it's like I'm gonna try to squeeze my arm in this now for you. It it's stuck. That's as absolute far as it's going to go. The arms are extremely tight on this, so while it may be long uh, and look big on me, uh, the, the arms really make it tight, especially on someone like me that's uh, got uh, quite big arms compared to some people in the 66 class. Uh, I struggle to get into the bench shirts, combining that with not as much experience with the bench shirts as some of the people I tend to size on the uh, steady aside so overall would I recommend this shirt yes especially when you consider the price that uh, UK retailer Pullum are charging only £115 that's cheaper than a Fury that's ridiculously priced uh, it's so cheap that's what I mean I can just go and buy another one of these uh, without too much hassle obviously it's still a good whack of money but when we're looking at price guides on Pullum it's like a Fury costs about hundred and thirty pound. A Super Katana low collar costs about hundred and uh, sorry two hundred and fifty pound. It's a lot of money for your two hundred and fifty pound. You can go and get two of these shirts. You still have twenty pound to play with. Go and get some another pair of wrist wraps uh, from uh, Oni. Uh, again, any any Oni gear is now for sale on Pullum. So go and check that out if uh, you're interested in trying this kit. Uh, like I said, I would highly, highly recommend this uh, if you're equipped and on a bit of a budget. Because uh, again, this compromises price uh, with performance, I believe. So definitely go and check this out. On a side note, uh, I was uh, doing a wrestling show the weekend just gone. Uh, with the format that the footage has been sent to me via email, uh, I can't do a YouTube video on it and show you the matches that I performed in. So if you're interested in that, uh, give me a DM on Instagram. That's uh, Gregory Bygall Pearson. Uh, give me a DM there. Uh, I can uh, send you the message out of there if you're interested. Uh, but yeah, that that's that. Uh, I've got two 20-minute matches, so there's some good quality time. You can uh, watch me and uh, give me any feedback, uh, what you like from my matches, uh, any big moves that you want me to try. But ending it here with uh, a video that uh, from the Homura Bench Press T-shirt. Uh, I'm gonna show you me bench pressing 130 kilos in this, and I'm warning you, it goes up fast. So can't wait to join you next week where we're gonna have another video based on equipped benching. So join in, and uh, I can't wait to see you then.